As the Cabinet Committee on Security is close to approve the purchase of 26 Rafale Marine fighter jets for its newest aircraft carrier INS Vikrant, media reports indicate that the Indian Navy will purchase over 150 meteor-long-range BVR missiles for its 26 Rafale Marine fighters. The Mac 4 capable meteor missile has an operational range of 200 km, and has the ability to engage highly maneuverable targets in a heavy electronic countermeasures environment. The BrahMos NG air launched missile will also be ready by 2026, and apart from Tejas Mark 1A and Su-30 aircraft, they will also be deployed on the Rafale aircraft in a twin or single weapon loadout. The Director of National Aerospace Laboratories has told the media that the RTA-90 regional transport aircraft will require $1 billion funding for full-scale engineering development and another $1 billion for the development of prototypes and setting up a production line in the country with industrial partners. He also said that after the project definition phase is over by September, it will provide a detailed report to the Indian government for funding. The Director of National Aerospace Laboratories has said that the SARAS Mark II program is currently going through a detailed design phase, and once drawings are completed, it will enter the fabrication stage, followed by a rollout and flight test by early 2025. The Indian Air Force will initially place orders for 15 units SARAS Mark II to ferry high-ranking Air Force officials, and National Aerospace Laboratories has plans to develop a special variant with sensors and payload for intelligence and surveillance missions. Officials of China's Aero Engine Corporation have revealed that mass production of the WS-15 engine for the J-20 fighter program has begun, indicating that the engine program has reached a certain level of maturity. The first flight of the J-20 with WS-15 engines was conducted last year, which has significantly improved the power-to-weight ratio of J-20 aircraft with a maximum thrust of 180 kN, that makes it comparable to the Pratt & Whitney F-119 engine on the Lockheed Martin F-22. The Chinese Air Force is operating over 150 J-20 aircraft and they will soon switch to WS-15 engines, which will provide the J-20 with supercruise capabilities. According to a parliamentary panel report, the seven new defense public sector undertakings that were formed from the Ordnance Factory Board will experience a steep decline in their orders over the next five years. The committee has said that primarily the defense public sector undertakings are to supply arms and ammunition to the Indian Armed Forces, but the committee has recommended that more emphasis should be given to increase exports. The Indian government is set to approve a proposal to build an additional 875 km road worth 13,000 crore rupees in 37 different locations near the China border, out of which 70% of the road is being built in the state of Arunachal Pradesh. The government has fast-tracked creation of smart model villages and development in areas closer to border with China, to ramp up local connectivity and deploy troops at much shorter duration. Oh, my God.